I think I want to check out some Children of the Corn. Children of the Corn. Now, what's interesting, I don't know if you even knew this, Meg. Uh, there is a red band trailer. So there's a green band trailer and then a red band trailer. Uh, if you guys don't know, green band is a, like more of a, a PG-13 version or PG version of a trailer. And a red band would obviously be a rated R. Um, so let's just get directly into it, guys. Uh, and I will be pausing along the way just because I like to offer my commentary. If you guys don't like that, then I'm so sorry, but that's what it is. Let's check out this trailer for the new Children of the Corn. I believe it's a reboot. So RLJE, I've definitely picked up a, a few of their films, uh, mainly from the Dollar Tree and whatnot. And some of them are good, some are not. So let's just get, you guys let me know. Children of the Corn, is it something that you want rebooted? Now, if you guys have been following the channel recently, about three or four months ago, I, I did watch it on the channel. I believe in the month of October, or maybe around that time. It was a creepy movie. I was overall okay. I gave it like a three or a 3.5 out of five, but it, it was good. It, it was a pretty good creepy movie. Now I hear there's like eight or nine movies. Uh, I don't know where you go from there, but you guys let me know. Do we need another Children of the Corn? And if, are you excited for this one? Okay, so Shudder, I love that. Love that, because I love Shudder. Prepare to witness the horrific rise of the next generation of evil. I love the narrator voice. When was the last time we got a trailer with the, uh, a movie trailer guy voice? Based on the short story. By Stephen King. Comes the nightmare. You guys let me know, do creepy kids scare you? And once again, do we need another Children of the Corn? Or is it time for people to kind of uh, find out about Children of the Corn if they haven't seen the originals? Like you've never seen it before. Mm, that was one thing that really did creep me out about Children of the Corn, guys, is the actual corn. The actual corn, If you, in case you guys uh, missed it, the actual corn does move around. I must have went back way too far. But the actual corn, right there. The actual corn does move in the original. I know. It sucks. Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. The kids. So the original kids... Looked very creepy. Oh my God. Do you guys see that in the bottom right hand corner, by the way? I don't know if you can see that. There is a body. So they already killed somebody. These kids don't look too creepy. Now, when I think Children of the Corn, you got to go full hereditary on me. A24, you, these kids need to look inbred to creep me out. These look like they just picked up some kids at a regular school one day. Not really terrified of them. I mean, I was ter terrified of uh, of Malachi and freaking uh, J what the hell was his name? Jacob or Job or something like that. So hard sometimes you can hardly breathe. But I can help with your pain. Mm. Brace yourself. He who walks. He talked to me. Uh oh. Took care of me. So now I'm going to take care of you. Ooh, ooh. By killing all the adults. For starters. Okay. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Jeez. He walks. This is our world now. Oh, wow. The little girl in the forefront seems very commanding. Which I'm guessing is the... Malachi character, maybe? Oh, oh, oh my god. Hold on. <laughs> we're getting some <laughs> real quick kills. Like, oh man, we're getting some uh that that's the one I was looking for. Someone got their face just like mutilated right here. Oh man. Okay. Children of the corn. It doesn't look that bad. Oh, Oh, are they going to show, like, the monster? Oh, wow. Coming March 3rd. Talk about March numbers, man. Uh, I mean, we're, we're just talking about, like, 
movies that come out in March, but okay. Very, very excited for that one. You guys let me know your thoughts in the chat. Return of the corn. Boogie is saying, I got freaked out at the cornfields now for sure. It's little things like that sometimes that are that are the most scary, right? You know, just to kind of uh, like it could be anyone, uh, you know, at any time. I mean, anyone being these kids, you know, and they don't look too menacing. And that's what's even scarier is that they kind of blend in. They blend into everything, right? Ooh, that's creepy. Okay. I, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of on board for it. If the kills are cool, if the kills are cool, because the story is kind of a little hollow as far as like motivation wise, like why they're doing all of this. It wasn't really explained too much from what I remember in the first movie. There was a lot of plot holes. Was it, uh, oh, it was Isaac. I'm sorry. If I had two, two sons, I wanted the name uh, Isaac and Malachi from the original Children of the Corn, but my wife wouldn't have it. Oh, that's so funny. JT is saying Isaac and Malachi. Yeah. Now, those original kids, th they looked crazy. They looked absolutely crazy. I wanted to answer this question um, from JT No BS. He said, of course, they have to do a gender swap of Isaac character. Nope, I don't think I'll bother. Now I hate forced uh, changes to appease the minority. Hmm. How do you guys feel about that? I mean, me personally, it didn't take anything away from uh, me being creeped out by kids or children of the corn. To me, that means you're you're telling me that that uh, little girls are not as creepy as little boys. Uh, and I think you can find creepiness. I had already said in that picture, none of those kids look creepy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, um, oh, I appreciate you, Velasca. Um, they could have done better at least with making the kids looking like like the hills have eyes, like you know what I mean. They look look looking a little creepier looking. Because that's what makes everything creepy. Of course, it's the ambiance, it's the atmosphere, it's everything around that, right? But you want the kids to look creepy, just visually creepy. I don't really care if it's gender swap or not. That really, that doesn't really get to me, though. So.